Hello my friends and welcome back. We have nothing to do except to find the enemy. Okay, it's a level one danger zone. That means it's time to strike at the Mafia some more. Oh! This guy's having a really good time or a really bad one. Need some help? Jeez, man, of course I need some help. Mugged? Dunno, sort of mugged. It was a mugging style scenario with a defined perpetrator and victim roles, but without the requisite transfer of goods. A bit some weirdo in a mask. No offense or anything, but this guy was way weirder than you. <laughs> you bit a churcher. Clamp my jaws around his ankle and let him have it. Okay, so he got his ass beat. Stude Lebronson. Can tell that he has been injured as he has some cuts and bruises on his face. You call an ambulance, wait and leave. Okay, and that's it. I wish this map would stick with the last mode that you had on. Right, let's uh, let's go again, shall we? Neatly lined, cool shadow beech trees stand sentinel outside pristine homes that look like they fell off some assembly line. The place exudes an aura of pleasant entropy. Upscale, but not too upscale. The mafioso quits running a few paces from the assassin. Not bad practice, all things considered. Boys have the place surrounded. Just say the word and we'll flush him. What? The assassin isn't in a rush. He nods. Takes a lazy pull from his cigarette. Sure, in a minute. Look, can we just get this done? What's eating you? Nothing, I don't know. Something shit. I've been on edge ever since I got out of bed today. Bad feeling. Same as the day Joey D got clipped. This guy, what'd he do anyway? Same thing anyone who got gets a visit from us did. Something other than what the boss told them to. Standing outside the domicile of Rikers City Police Captain Bill Manning. Or Booze Hound Bill, as he's known in the department. Our friend Bill is not amenable to acquiring a selective myopia in exchange for currency. <laughs> he, won't, he won't be bribed. He won't be corrupted. Boss might have left him alone if it was just that. Cops can be like that sometimes, uncooperative. But Bill doesn't care for dirty cops either. He's wound up all... He's wound up all the way to nine on plans for some sort of departmental shakedown, which may expose our in-place assets. Hey, Jumpy, let's get this done. Fire a shot in the air to warn the captain. Fire a shot at the hitman. Well, my presence is garbage, so let's go with firearms. One enemy damaged, nine enemies distracted. The shot shatters the urban calm and wings the Mafia plumber. The unexpected direction of attack puts the Mafia on the back foot. Haggard, nearly naked man staggers out the front door, roaring and blazing away at the mobsters with a large pistol. <laughs> yes, yes, let's kill him. Oh man, we've got a naked, naked police captain on our team. <laughs> That's hilarious. Where are my dudes? How can I do a tactical repositioning of my dudes when I can't see my dudes? Where are they? Okay. Wow, we're miles away. We gotta get in there and help him. Or he's gonna end up shrekt. Buddy, you need to run. Uh, we 
we're like miles away from where we need to be. Hmm. Let's move yeah, I'm on it. and overwatch the bat. Understood. 52, seems reasonable. The guy has a fear aura, it looks like. Fearsome presence. Demoralized, believes they will lose the engagement. Distracted, starts the next turn with 50% AP. Sweet. The guy has a revolver. And he knows how to use it. Nice. That ought to have spiced up his life. Ha! <laughs> he hasn't got enough APs to do anything, so he just sat there like a tool. Da, doing it. Da, doing it. Ooh, just out of range to get them both. 70%, I'm probably better off uh, handgunning the guy. 83, yep. Oh, nice shot. Got it. Haha, <laughs> they got so many stat penalties on them that right now they can't do jack. Hey, buddy. How about a nice old knifey knifey? Got it. How many APs is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh man, if only I could get close enough to apply the bat. Twice. Just have to settle for three stabbings. Nice! <laughs> This mission looked really hard, but actually, I should be able to evacuate our favorite naked police chief here. Understood. Rat. This guy is critically injured. And the old naked police chief here could actually nail him to the wall if I didn't want to run. The other ones are quite far away. Oh! 
he missed on a 95. Oh, come on. Da, doing it. Oh, nice shot. I can't believe you missed on a 95. If you die now, it's your own stupid fault. Except the guy actually has loads of HP and apparently quite a high armor class. Because he only took 5 damage there. Let's go and tie this one up. Ten AP. Perfect. For two bangs. Oh wait, no. I have uh seven. Knife. Nice. Critical hit. Understood. Cool, it's another one cleared. Don't miss again. Oh ho ho ho! That worked. Looks like another enemy has arrived. Da, doing it. Ooh, nice shot. These mafioso are uh, in big trouble now. Wrecked. Got it. Uh... Yeah, why not? Just hold him in melee check. There's one closing in on, on us from behind here. Oh, fastest gun triggered. I need to reload. Can't do it. Understood. Oh ho ho ho! Man, this guy is good. Well, I suppose you don't get to be the chief of the police without being a badass, I suppose. I mean, not in a violent city like this. Da, doing it. Oh, that was a good shot, too. Oh, reinforcements. Mm, everyone's too far away right now. Feels like a handgun situation. Ah, beautiful. Got it. Got a free point of firearms EXP out of it, so that's good. Yeah, I'm on it. Can't do it. OK. 
Okay. Can't um, do it. Guns reloaded, but don't have enough AP to fire it, sadly. Wow, 70% 70, 70 chance to hit on a snap from there. Nice. These last two goons haven't got a hope in hell. Oh, you were close enough for the knife. Well, that definitely hurt. I don't know how much extra damage critical hits do. They seem to do a reasonable amount, though. But the numbers don't seem that much bigger than what you would expect. Yeah, I'm on it. Understood. Okay, one hit on 50%. Pretty sure this revolver is out of range. Not quite. He had to reload his six shooter. Da, doing it. You get nothing. You get nothing. Nuts to this, I'm out of here. She says. As I shank the last of her allies. Got it. Oh, missed. Okay, he looks good for an alcoholic who woke up on the wrong side of a gunfight. His voice is level with an adrenal edge of a growl, like a big cat getting ready to get rough. These scumbags didn't know that my wife, my kid, and my wife weren't home. Didn't give a shit. You fucked up this time. You thought I was coming down on you hard before. When I'm done, you're gonna think a bridge fell on you. <laughs> you're depopulating the criminal underworld like the Black Death. Your victims aren't exactly. Models of civic virtue, but the law's the law. Right now, I've got bigger problems, but as soon as I put the lid on this... Sh on this... Unsafe for YouTube sentence! <laughs> you and I are going to have a chat, and you aren't going to like it. Tell me what you know. Your new friend is well enough connected to know where one of the potential dudes are. Cash not found. This is a load of trash. Wow, 75 assault rifle rounds. No assault rifle though, but nice to have the ammunition. The Mafia are planning a raid on District F4. What the hell's a raid? F4.
Hmm. They're planning a raid on F4, but I don't understand what that really means. Mafia are raiding F4. Mouse over the district and press the raid button at the bottom right to intervene. Raids are special scenarios in which you must prevent criminals from fleeing an area with stolen goods. Well, that sounds like fun. I'm going to presume that you can't load two different kinds of ammunition. I'm sort of going to presume that you can't skip time. You have to do the raid right now. Ooh! Rascal 94! Great damage, great range, great capacity, medium caliber rounds, great accuracy. Look at this beast. Nice. Oh, and what do we have here? Combat machete. And that is better than the combat knife. It is clearly better. How much is that sweet assault rifle? 710. It's a lot of money. That is a lot of money. Okay, um, I don't know, I don't know if this raid situation means that we can't, uh, I don't know if that means that we can't pass any time, like, can I not even repair my gear? Let's make a save and find out, why not? Does not... You know, the game is not telling me. Oh, I'm writing end of episode here, like I'm on autopilot. Game is not telling me if, uh, if it's time sensitive. So can I just repair my gear? Okay, and is the raid still there? Yes, it is. Uh, let's just go for it. We've never seen a raid before, so I don't know what the threat level is. During a raid, criminals will attempt to flee the area with stolen goods. Each criminal that escapes, the gang will gain cash. Additional enemies will spawn at intervals. Some will attempt to flee, whereas others will engage you in combat. Okay. But where will they try and flee to? Where are they going to attempt to flee to? Doesn't say. I mean, they're not going to turn around and just run off the back of the map, are they?
Got it. How did it reset back to snap? Ugh. Yeah, I'm on it. Okay, just wait in Overwatch mode. You... Uh, delay position. Da, doing it. can just delay till these idiots get closer. Hopefully I can put a nice wide shotgun blast through the whole group. Understood. Brat. Oh, ho, ho, that definitely found some damage. You're not getting away with the money, my friend. Let's go overwatch, because I'm sure that they're going to try and run past... You know, I could. I could dump the old great purifying flame grenade right in their path. I <laughs> guess who's not getting away? Okay, I've got four AP left, so I can just go on Overwatch, I guess. None of these shots are particularly great. Delay. Hmm. I think it's possible to get a reasonable shot. From a weird angle. Da, doing it. Nope. I like the shotgun. It's a very tactical weapon. It's actually kind of cool. Oh, you just walked into stabby knife time. Come closer. Come closer, my friends. Huh, I wasn't expecting him to go over there. Does that mean that that one is going to do the same thing? Understood. Okay, fine. Yep, they are.
They're also right next to the exploding barrel. Got it. I'm almost tempted to actually just stab, stab it with my knife. Got it. I was tempted to stab it with my knife just to guarantee that it would go off. I don't know where these guys are running to, but they ain't getting away. Got it. Oh, they're both dead. That was enough to end them. Sweet. Okay. In that case, we interrupt your usual programming to uh, do whatever we want to these people. I'm going to actually switch that back in. Because eight, he generates eight action points, and eight action points are best distributed between one knife slash at three and one bat strike at, at uh, five. Obviously, can't do it this turn, but could do it next turn. Understood. Rat. Oh, nice hits. Oh, there's another one. Da, doing it. And dead. Is this one going to go running through the flame? Got it. I've got loads of AP. Let's pull the bat out. Let's put the bat on Overwatch. Come round the corner! Come round the corner, my friend. I've got something just for you. I should have batted him for five instead of knifing. The uh, AP bar doesn't seem that responsive at times. It's kind of a little bit awkward delay. Oh, evaded the bat. Evaded the bat. Understood. Da, doing it. Oof. Knifed. Ooh, that was a, a bit of a trade there. Drop the goods. Wow, they just keep on coming. Understood. Overwatch. Delay turn position. <sighs> Aha! Da, doing it. Guess who's lined up for a blast? Oh, beautiful. You won't get away, you won't get away, get away! <laughs> Again, I should have batted her here. I have two AP spare. I'm really not managing my AP very well here. And I have gotten kind of lazy with the fact that I, I know that this battle is in the bag.
It is sometimes it is a little bit difficult to calculate how many that you have. I would love to have a number on the end actually telling you how many AP you've got. Because counting these spots is actually, for whatever reason, I just find them difficult to read at a glance. Understood. Mini Gongo Burr. Ooh, three hits. Let's pull the handgun back out. Da, doing it. Wrecked. Strategic victory! Tell me about your mommy. Look at all that loot. Nothing too exciting, but hey, medkits. A flame grenade. At least I think that's a flame grenade. Oh, two machetes. <gasps> what did we just find? We just found something cool. Oh, and four, four other grenades. I think that's the explosive one. Victory! Five out of five enemies stopped. Cash reward, 700 bucks. That's amazing. There was also a flash of notifications on the side of the screen there, which I didn't get, as usual. Unfortunately. But man, 700 bucks. That's a lot of money. That would pay for an upgrade to something. Player prowess bonus one. Huh. Which would increase melee damage even more. Upgrading the range would get us free small, medium, and shotgun caliber shells. More medical supplies, faster healing. <clears throat> Another 0.5 HP recovered for everybody when resting. Studying hard. That prowess bonus was actually pretty big. I think these bonuses apply to everybody, so there's definitely some utility in having some close combat capability. Lots of free ammunition. Ah oh, man, it's a hard choice. Let's go with the gym. I think it makes sense. Because the only character you're always stuck with is the main character, and my main character is a melee character, so... That extra one prowess and extra 6% damage... 
it's going to be pretty big. Hmm, who knows? Even when we sell some stuff, we might even have spare money. I don't think I need these light firearms anymore. I found a load of them, it would seem, and hammers and machetes. Four standard hand grenades and one flame. We can't really see what our trade skill... It's, the lack of information is killing me in this game sometimes. Can't really see what our trade skill is 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 buying for us. Eurocourt Artemis. 4 to 14 tiles effective range. 6 round capacity, medium caliber rounds, 120% accuracy. Hits like a freight train. Hundred and twenty percent accuracy. You know what's funny? This might be a good weapon for someone who only shoots occasionally. Like the Uzi is definitely gonna pump out more damage. Ah, oh, I mean, that said, maybe not. With the correct perks, the Uzi would probably pump out more damage. I know who would benefit most from this weapon. It's old Akadi here. It's not Sergei at all. Akadi. A caddy? Because he is decent at firearms, but he is using a handgun as his alternate. This is going to give him a powerful, long-reach capability. And the fact that he can, uh, that it's 120% accuracy is going to help him to nail those shots. That his poor, not poor firearm skill, but he doesn't really have the right stats. He doesn't have the right stats to be an actually really good shooter. So a sniper rifle might actually enable him to be more useful. So close to leveling up, not quite there. Not quite there yet. Lovely weapon though. Could definitely do well with some upgrades. Oh, this has gone down to 49 bucks. Things are getting cheaper down here. Stock up on uh, on bits for armor, and also my my level has increased through trade. 
pretty cool. Plus one core stat. Increases close combat damage. I was going to go for toughness to get AP bank at toughness six. That would also make my character much harder to kill. Yeah, it is a pretty solid bonus. Toughness increases that healing rate. Also increases the maximum amount of AP you can hold. Interestingly. Yeah, as much as prowess is going to uh, increase all of my melee stats, I want the toughness for the AP bank at level 6. I think that's a very powerful trait and I want it so there we go plus I could really do with some more hit points for this character especially since it's the character that you have to rest all the time more toughness means greater healing rate as well which means less time wasted resting okay He's got a perk. Reduces the minimum range of precision rifles by two. got a minimum range of four, hasn't it? Enemies in this character's command radius suffer a 7% chance to hit penalty when attacking. That's pretty amazing. Increases chance of successfully interrogating by 10%. Huh. One AP for the entire team. There's so many nice perks here. Doubles the character's area of influence, allowing them to inflict fear and terror on distant enemies. How do you get fear and terror, though? Oh, I guess this is fear. Gain 8% wealth at the end of every day. Does not stack. Passive bonus. <laughs> Compound interest, baby. Greatest force in the universe. Oh, I wonder if someone else who I'm not going to use would could get that. Let's go with Fearsome Presence. The guy has got a massive aura. We might as well take advantage of it. Okay, he can get critical charge. Yeah, you can aim for body parts, but it reduces your chance to hit so much. I'm not sure if it's ever worth it. I think you just need incredible 
uh, incredibly high stats to actually make that worth it. Anyway, critical charge is definitely a solid perk. She can also get critical charge. Firing position. Attacks with precision rifle cost minus one AP if you have not moved during the current round. Ops Specialist. Reduces the amount of time required to complete an operation by 40%. Should not be picked for Sam. <laughs> Cut. Like, can't you just disable it for Sam? Can't you just programmatically mark it so that this trait is not one that Sam can get? <laughs> I mean, I get why, but... <laughs> Let's go with that critical charge, shall we? This is the police. I'm not really wanting to do anything with her right now. And that's fine. <clears throat> Should get her trade up and make her my uh, investor. He's the only one with a high enough trade score to actually get that perk. But I don't know how I feel about getting non-combat perks. Even ones as delicious as that. I think fast reload is actually a very solid pick for anyone who's going to be shooting. Yeah, I definitely like the idea of the uh, of the investor perk. <laughs> Every day, gain eight percent money. Well, that would encourage you to hold on to your money, though. But I mean, that's a uh, that's that's got potential to be significant if you started to get runaway currency. Yeah, there's really no point in bringing up his stats, is there? You 
can build a completely unarmed character and get lots of bonuses for doing it. But I don't think unarmed attacks are really very spicy. Three point eight unarmed. You can upgrade your unarmed. That's so weird to me. <laughs> you can upgrade. You can upgrade your unarmed. Still does half the damage of a. Uh, Half the damage of a proper weapon. Oh, I can upgrade this now as well. Okay, well, anyway, we're out of time. So that is it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time.